Tabor Communications has a portfolio of publications that collectively cover the fastest computers in the world and the people who run them. Since 1992, HPC Wire has been the leading publication for news and information for the world of high-performance computing. HPC in the Cloud is the only portal dedicated to covering data-intensive cloud computing in science, industry, and the data center. Datanami is the news portal dedicated to providing insight, analysis, and up-to-the-minute information about the emerging trends and the solutions in big data and analytics. Through a partnership with the National Center for Manufacturing Sciences, Digital Manufacturing Report covers news and information about the fast-moving world of digital manufacturing, modeling, and simulation. Through a partnership with the Green IT Council out of Washington, D.C., Green Computing Report covers the green efficiencies in the data center. Our organization dates back to 1986. In 1986, we launched Supercomputing Review Magazine. Supercomputing Review Magazine was the definitive publication covering high performance, advanced computing technologies globally. In 1992, Tabor Communications acquired Supercomputing Review Magazine. I almost can't remember a day that there wasn't a Tabor Communications. It's been around for so long, and it's been just this uh, a journalistic centerpiece of the whole community. It's actually tied together the whole community, going back to the days when it was a paper publication. I particularly remember when Tom Tabor took it to be an online publication, and I remember thinking, what in the world is he doing? putting a magazine online. How can that possibly work? And of course, now we know everyone's going online, but he was as far ahead in the journalism area as, as companies like uh, Cray and Intel are in the supercomputing area, trying to get ahead of things. Since 1982, when Convex Computer was started, and I was the co-founder, and that's when the HPC business was just evolving in the world. It was still a rather niche boutique business. And like any business and market, you want to make sure your ideas get out the market gets out, the concepts. And going back to that early time, it was clear that HPC Wire and Tabor Communications was the leader in that area and helped us in messaging, it helped the industry in messaging, and where people thought, you know, what is this? You could, always, you know, what is this? What does it mean a supercomputer? What does it mean a high performance computer? You could always reference them to HPC Wire and that benefited the industry as a whole, so it was extremely beneficial. A lot of uh, momentum behind, uh, you know, HPC Wire. A lot of interest. It generates, uh, you know, leads for us and business. So basically, I think Tabor Communications can actually take the message that we give out in a very professional way to uh, the right target of audience that we want to reach. So I've known Tom really since since day one, and he's impressed me as uh, a visionary. He, he's been in this industry, I think, 25 or 26 years. He. He virtually knows everybody, but, but more importantly, as the CEO of our company, he has a keen understanding of where HPC is going, what are the important aspects of HPC, what are the important technologies, what are the right vendors, who our audience is, and he has a keen understanding of where this industry is going. Tom and I actually met one year ago, and, uh, and so we started talking. Uh, there was, uh, I think, instant clickability. Uh, got him introduced to our CEO, Rick Jarman, and uh, voila, the Digital Manufacturing Report was born and it's been uh, just a phenomenal, I think, relationship with uh, Tabor and NCMS since. HPC Wire is one of those few organs that actually effectively and in detail covers the HPC marketplace. There are very few people that do that and I can't think of anyone else who's got the history, the legacy and just the depth that HPC Wire has in that realm. Tabor Communications is such a vital part of the HPC community, it can really serve as a nexus for forming relationships, forming partnerships uh, with vendors, with end users, with policy makers across the HPC ecosystem. It's important because everybody goes to HPC Wire and its sister publications also to look at what's happening. And uh, we as a vendor, we just need to be there. Uh, you need to be able to see our, our logo, our, our presence in, in the market uh, by being present on, on your um, web, web properties. 
for us, we really focus on the high performance computing market solely. And so HPC Wire and Tabor have been just an important part of our marketing programs for a long time. Not just from launching new products, but also from being able to get unique messages out that our company has about how we're different in the uh, HPC market overall. When you look at Tabor Communications, we have a legacy in high performance computing. The quality of our editorial is undisputed. Our, our reach is global. You know, so if you wanted to, to, to reach into China, if you wanted to reach into India, if you wanted to reach into Asia Pac, if you wanted to reach into Latin America, if you wanted to reach into EMEA, Europe, Middle East, and Africa, and most certainly the Americas, there is no other publication that covers our niche that has the reach that we have. So when you look at this community, when you look at the space we cover, no matter what discipline, what segment, we have been covering the fastest computers in the world and the people who run them for over 20 years.